In 2023, there are regulations coming into force about the safe use of diocyanates. This video will explain everything you need to know in order to comply with those regulations. Hi, I'm Tom. In this video, I'll be talking about the new regulations around the safe use of diocyanates that we implemented in August 2023. I'll be going over what these regulations state, why these regulations are coming into force, and what you can do in preparation to comply with these regulations. What are diocyanates? Diocyanates are a key ingredient in the production of polyurethane foams, coatings and adhesives. They are highly reactive and could cause skin and respiratory irritation as well as allergies in some individuals, especially those who are frequently exposed to them in an occupational setting. What are the diocyanate regulations? The regulations say that diocyanate shall not be used on their own or in mixtures for industrial or professional use after August 24, 2023 unless A. The concentration of diocyanates is less than 0% by weight or B. The employer ensures that professional and industrial users have completed training on the safe use of diocyanates before using products containing more than 0.1% of the chemical. Why are the regulations coming into force? Diocyanates caused over 5,000 confirmed cases of new occupational diseases in Europe in 2020, although the actual number is estimated to be much greater than this. Diseases like asthma can result from repeated exposure to diocyanates. So in response to this, the REACH Committee voted in favour of the European Commission's proposal for a REACH restriction on diocyanates. Now, companies using products containing diocyanates must prepare in order to comply with the regulations when they're implemented on the 24th of August in 2023. What can you do in preparation for the regulations? In preparation to comply with these regulations, you have two options. The first is to ensure that all operatives receive the correct training. This option is best if you are happy with the product you are using and you don't want to change. The second option is to look for alternatives. This option is best if you don't want to go through the training process, which can be time consuming and costly. So now that you know about both options, it's time to decide what to do next. If you want to learn more about both those options, we suggest you watch our helpful video going over these options in more detail. It will go over the pros and cons of each option to ensure you are prepared for the implementation on August 24th, 2023. However, if you want to learn more about these diocyanate regulations, we suggest you read the article we wrote. It goes over great detail about these regulations. Thanks for watching, and if you want to speak to an adhesive expert about the diocyanate regulations, we would love to assist. <laughs>